Hey guys, Kamara's name, episode 5 is the game. In the last episode, we came here to Hawaii on our school field trip. We found out that Yusuke um, had his trip uh, redirected here because of a bad storm that's going on in Los Angeles. And in this episode, we will be uh, scouring the beach to talk to people about the Phantom Thieves and enjoying the rest of our time here in Hawaii. Cool. I really wonder though if in reality all of these people speak Japanese. Like, I highly doubt it. <laughs> I mean, I could be wrong, but. Whoa! And there's no way that Ryuji's understanding in this amount of English either, so I guess they're speaking Japanese because, like, Ryuji can't understand any English. <laughs> cool. And you? Alright, well, we talked to those people, uh, and actually, wait a second, we know you! Hey. Uh, yeah, this is the girl who got, got out of the limo. <laughs> Our little icon is wearing away in the bottom right corner, I like that, I like that, um, attention to detail. But yeah, we saw her get out of the limo at the firework festival, and we also saw her watering, um, the flowers in front of the school, so... This person's, um, a reoccurring character. Um... And she's wearing a skirt from our school, so she's with our school. Which I guess is kind of obvious, but she's a student, I guess, is what I'm getting at. What do you mean? Are you a Shujin student? I mean, look at her skirt. Uh, what about you? <laughs> oh, yeah. He was. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. I mean, honestly, free trip to free trip to Hawaii, I would take it too. What's up? Oh, hey guys. Huh? Oh, you just don't want to interact with them? Interesting. It's kind of Mm, not shady, but, hmm, it's, it's a little suspicious. Yeah, shouldn't you know her? Oh, okay. Alright, well, back to the hotel. So, is that it for the day? Aw, oh, come on. Man, our time in Hawaii is flying by. Oh yeah, how's it going along? Found it. Found what? One after another, too. Huh? What did you find? Well, Gunna seems to be doing a little bit better. Still working, can't tell you. Oh, come on, Futaba. <laughs> she can handle this without me. Well, Gunna, stop. Get rid of the inferiority complex, okay? You're important and you're valid. Ooh, so much. All I'm good for is driving them around in mementos. No. False. We would never have gotten this far without you, and you're a good friend. We like having you around. I'm basically useless. Ah. Uh. Kitty, your mumbling's distracting me. Why don't you say something nice? If you got something to say, just spit it out. Morgana's been speaking. It's nothing. What were you saying? <laughs> Let me go! You feel so nice. I do not! <laughs> Would you rather feel, like, bad? So smooth and silky. It's kind of hard to believe fur this soft belongs to a human. That's a nice thing to say. Don't make me say it again. I'm a human! She basically disagreed to that. Couldn't you just be assuming that? I had the wrong assumptions about my mom for the longest time. It's not the same. I understand myself better than anyone. That 
that's true. <sighs> Something needs to happen with Morgana because I'm getting concerned. Uh, I don't know. Anyways. Even more posts now. Oh, really? Ah, oh, man. I can see the stars out through the window. Ah, oh, that must be so nice. We need to have a stargazing night. That is a requirement by the end of this game. I mean, don't tell me whether or not we get one or not, but gosh, I really want to have a stargazing night. I mean, I guess we kind of had time at the observatory, but like, I would love to go out on the beach with our friends right now and just lie down on our backs and just look up and take it in. Oh, wow. The president of a company called Okumura Foods is rising very quickly up the rankings. Huh, that's twice we've heard about him now. Well, three times actually. I'm pretty sure that's the name that Sai told us in our, like, flash forward. We're on a, yeah, we're on a trip, you know, dude. Come on, relax. Come on, you can't let this chance pass you by. It's not gonna pass me by. It's gonna be there when we get back to Japan. It's rumored that Okumura Foods exploits their employees. Stuff like underpaying staff to reduce labor costs, that's how they have so many stores. What's up? Who's that? Wait, was that Ryuji? Oh, hey. Yo. Hey, Ryuji. Why are you here? Just hear me out. The guy I'm rooming with went and brought his girlfriend back to the room. Oh, no. I felt totally awkward staying in there with him. I'm just gonna sleep here tonight. Oof. Sorry, buddy. Even though there are only two beds? Coming! Who else is here? We don't, wait, you, uh, it can only be Yusuke. Uh, Takamaki? Wait, what? Is that allowed on this trip? The girl I was sharing a room with took off to her boyfriend's room. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, we've connected the dots. I know that feeling. And she took the key. So you're locked out? I stepped outside for just a second and the auto lock kicked in. I can't get back in my room. Oh, man. Huh? You're looking at stuff online even over here? Ever since the Medjet case, many people from overseas have been accessing the website. Isn't it crazy? The Phantom Thieves are finally making their worldwide debut. Oh, what should I do about overseas requests? I don't think we're the ones you should ask about that. I'm gonna say this now. There has been a shift in Mishima's character recently, and I haven't not noticed it. Something's up with him. I don't know exactly what's up with him, but something's up with him. Don't comment on what I just said. Whether I'm right or wrong about my suspicions, just let them be. They took down Medjet. I wonder who they'll bring justice to next. It's not just Japan anymore. The whole world's waiting to see the Phantom Thieves' next move. But how, we can, t how can we take on a target that's not based out of Japan, though? Like, we would have to be... Somewhere else, like Hawaii. Are we gonna take on our next target on our trip? There's no way. That reminds me, what time is it? No, no way. <sighs> oh, so sleepy. I guess it must be late. I'm feeling pretty pooped. You think this could be that jet lag thing? Yeah, it takes a little while to recover. It'll be too much hassle for me to go anywhere else. I'll just sleep in here tonight. Uh, that's allowed? I'm surprised that the teachers aren't, like, making room checks and checking to make sure that no one's in here. I don't know, I feel like that's a thing that would happen on a school trip normally. Wait, what? I don't- I don't know if that's a good idea. Are you serious? Don't worry, I trust you guys. Uh, thanks, I guess? I saw that one coming. There are only two beds. Even if someone sleeps on the sofa. Someone's out to sleep together. Oh, come on. We're gonna end up sleeping with Ryuji, aren't we? One of us is gonna have to sleep on the floor. So who's that gonna be? Hmm. I'll do it. Oh, hey, playing cards. Why don't we use these to decide? No, no, no. I'll take it. I'll take the floor. Yes! What? 
<laughs> I'm all the way in Hawaii, and I'm stuck sleeping on the floor. <laughs> hey, where'd Mishima go? What's Mishima doing out? He's in the bathroom. Ah, uh, okay. So everyone's awake? Ain't he been in there a while? What's he doing in the bathroom so long? Is he sick? The school trip. Shiho was really looking forward to this. Oh man. On. Sorry, I didn't mean to bring the mood down. But it's already been almost six months since then, hasn't it? <laughs> this all feels so strange. Yeah, time flies. Right? Hard to believe the rowdy kids at school are now famous all over the world. Don't you think we still have a lot to learn about each other, though? I'd say so. You know, things like what kind of people we like. So, time to come clean, Ryuji. Ah, uh, really? <laughs> so we're having this conversation now? Me? Wait, are we asleep? Uh, well... Huh. She's gotta have a good personality. I'm okay with anyone who's modest and nice. What about if two girls with equally good personalities confess to you at the same time? Hmm. If they're equally nice, uh, then it'd have to be the one with the hotter bod. <laughs> Not the wording I would use, but I mean, if personality is the same, like, I get what he's saying. So looks are what's most important to you. No, he did just say that personality, he, like, he brought up personality first. He said that was the deciding factor if everything else was the same. What? <laughs> I guess that's the difference between, like, how, uh, like, the typical male brain works and a typical female brain works. Your first answer was just superficial. The second <laughs> answer was your true beliefs. Ah, okay. Well, maybe An's right. The prob she probably is right. There's some psychology there. Huh. So you really are that kind of guy. Oof. That ain't fair! <laughs> yeah, I mean, because if he had said it the other way around, I doubt you would have pulled the same logic. What about you? Come on, spill the beans. What kind of girl is your type? Oh, so we're not asleep. One with a great body. One who's really smart. One who's shrouded in mystery. I don't have a type. Hmm. Should I? <laughs> okay. Am I supposed to answer this the way that I think An or Ryuji would respect? Or am I supposed to answer this honestly? I'll answer this honestly. Uh, that's not the most important thing to me. That's... I mean, intelligence is nice, but that's not even it either. Um, I wouldn't say shrouded in mystery. Like, I don't, I mean, I guess I can be attractive, but that's not really like, I don't know. I just like people who are kind and outgoing. I don't know. I always wish I was more outgoing, which it's it's weird because people say that I'm, outgo I'm an outgoing person, but I'm also not. Um, and I just, yeah, I, I like people who are really outgoing and put themselves out there and I don't know yeah so I'll say this you totally dodged the question <laughs> well we answered honestly it's your turn next so what kind of guy do you yeah on oh no so what kind of guy do you <laughs> just gonna try to ignore it Uh, Mishima, come on. <laughs> Just wait, buddy. That doesn't sound good. You know, wasn't he drinking the tap water earlier? Oh, no, you never do that when you go somewhere new. That's like the one thing you're not supposed to do when you're out of the country. Damn, even Ryuji knows that. Oh, come on. We don't, we don't get to see what An's type is, boo! No, I believe that is a wise decision. Though it was some third-rate tabloids article, unnecessary information was leaked after all. Besides, his investigation of the Phantom Thieves showed no progress since then. Yes. There's a possibility that he'll betray us out of spite since he was let go. Wait, what? 
principal was fired and that's connected to this? Like, I knew there was a connection, but, like, that serious of a connection? Well, then. We'll make it so that it was a uh, heart attack. What? As usual, he'll be left to deal with the... Oh, I wouldn't have thought of that. Well played, sir. They're gonna kill off Kobayakawa? It no longer matters if we deal with one or two of those connected to us. What? We basically just got confirmation that the SIU director is involved with the metaverse and that whoever he's connected with has access to the metaverse and has been doing the same things with the mental shutdowns. Wow. <laughs> oh man. It's just Oh, okay. So you're a little bitter that you didn't get that action, I see. As I was saying. <laughs> Oh, yeah? Hmm. <laughs> oh, wow. Mishima, too? Neither of you have your eyes on someone right now? Okay. Hey. What? Come on. Yeah, who is it? Whoa. Oh yeah, you're totally right. Huh? What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I guess we're off to go looking for some ladies, I suppose. Uh, okay, so I guess I'm gonna walk off somewhere by myself and check this message. Oh, okay. Wait, what? From Ryuji. <laughs> oh. Okay. So if I was further my confidants with other people right now, I think I'd have the option to hang out with like, let's say, An or Makoto or Yusuke, but because Ryuji's the only one that I have this far, he's my only choice. Because, yeah. So I guess I'm, I'm guessing I'm hanging out with, with Ryuji. I don't know if that's gonna help our case or not getting into our swimsuits. I don't know if we've really looked in the mirror recently, Ryuji. Okay. Well, guess I'm going to the beach, and that's how I'm spending my afternoon. Not bad. Dude, there are a lot of babes here. Um, that look in your eyes scares me. <laughs> Yo, you're finally here. 
Yep, sorry to make you wait. Let's go make this vacation one to remember. Why is Mishima the one of, out of all three of us with the best posture? I mean, like, we both have really bad hunchbacks, but he's, his back is pretty straight. Will this really work? Probably not. We won't lose. You got this for you, dude. I love swimming. I don't think that's what he meant. <laughs> Alright, we want to go after solo girls that look bored. Got it? Is that your strategy? Okay. Let's roll. You said solo girls, but they're literally together. Oof. Ah. Uh, it's hot enough as is. Seeing those couples just makes my damn blood boil. Wait a sec. You smell something good? Coming from that food stand. Huh? Uh. Oh my gosh. That's actually Yusuke. What is he doing? Yo, Yusuke! Oh, it's you. Why are you wearing that hood on the beach again? Hello. Hmm. That stuff good? Shrimp? It is resplendent. Even in Hawaii, it's the same old Yusuke. <laughs> He's a weirdo. He's perverted. <laughs> That's an understatement. Yo. What? Would you take a look at them? They're incredible. <laughs> Mishima. Oh man, that voice crack was. Uh. Come on, we'll rock paper scissors for him if this goes well. Oh, they're not a prize, guys. Crossing an ocean just for this. <laughs> Aw, poor Yusuke. Hi there. Oh, y'all from Japan? Wait, does she have a southern accent? What a weird accent. Anyways, the four of us got some time on our hands, and, uh, you're including me in this? <laughs> oh, she's wearing, like, an American bathing suit. It's interesting. Well, if you ladies aren't doing anything, how about we go somewhere more fun? Please, show us around Hawaii. Mashima, that's not how this works. Sorry, we don't take too kindly to youngins. I'm all about the wealthy, refined, older man. <laughs> what is she, from South Carolina or something? I wouldn't have minded if you were those phantom thieves, though. Voluptuous lady. Oh no, Ryuji, don't spill it. For real? Oh, well, you know, we... Ryuji. Ah... Uh... Bye-bye. Come back in ten years. Oh my god. They brushed us away without a second thought. <laughs> How about you ask the Phantom Thieves for help, huh? They're all about stealing hearts, right? You can make those girls have a change of heart. <laughs> the way you said that, have a change of heart. Oh, I never thought of that. Oh no, you planted a very, very bad seed into Ryuji's brain. Oh, <laughs> this is what, <laughs> what I just said. This is absurd. Poor Yusuke. Man, shit went south real fast. Yep. Pretty sure that's where they were from, too. It's all your fault? Let's go on a food binge. That was a major defeat. <laughs> nah, let's go on a food binge. Shall we eat? Let's. <sighs> let's just head back. Oh, come on. Yeah, I'm beat. We should have done something more fun. Something less risky. 
Uh, I wonder what the other events would have been like. My confidants with the others were further enough along. <sighs> oh, sorry, Mishima. Is uh, lady hunting not really your thing? Yeah, it's not mine either. I mean, if we, if you're with Ryuji, you'll survive, Mishima. It was terrible for him too. Guess you have a good point. Wait, today was my last day in Hawaii, wasn't it? Ah, uh, man, the um belief rating is going up and up. Man, we haven't really done anything. Um. Ah, uh, I don't know. Like, I had fun on the trip, but I mean, I don't like. I guess we kind of spent some time together as a group, but I would have loved it if like we all went together on like I don't know, like a Ferris wheel or something or. I don't know if we all like did a coordinated group activity, but I mean we'll get more of those in the future. But but still, I mean it wasn't bad. It was a good trip. That aside, what was it gonna do? Like do a 180 and come back around? That's true. Oh yeah? <laughs> Aw, Adam's looking out for us. Huh? Oof. Uh, I don't know, Ryuji. There's kind of a difference between like, striking out and not playing the game. This lonely girl? Being alone is okay. You're the lonely one, Ryuji. Are you really lonely? Hmm. Being alone is okay. <sighs> Oof. <laughs> Alright then. Ah. It did. I definitely want to stay longer. <laughs> yeah. And already back home. Ah, uh, man. Oh no. no need for you of anger to direct her right now. But still, you would have eventually shut up if you just not I guess you got a point. Ah! <laughs> 
Whoa. He's dead. Oh my god. Yo, welcome back. I saw this, Jeff. It's my time to fulfill it. Hand a bit? How is Hawaii? Aloha! <laughs> He's been influenced. <laughs> uh, I can understand why. While you guys were off having fun, things here have gotten a bit more problematic. Oh yeah? So I've heard the surprisingly hot items at the moment are masks and calling cards. Oh no. Here's a graph of the profits for stores handling these items. Who is making this money? Double from last year. Phantom Thief goods seem to be in especially high demand. I didn't know they sold that kind of stuff. Should we try too? I mean, selling Phantom Thief merchandise? What about copyright? Like Phantom Thief Curry? Maybe I'll toss some dry ice on the side, you know? Give it that phantomy effect. <laughs> Not a bad idea, actually. Uh, I'm just joking, all right? Oh, come on! I wonder how our guests consider this recent phenomenon. What do you think, Akechi Kun? Um, I think it's obvious what he thinks. Well... There he is, the anti-thief detective. Still, though, Kobayakawa, he's been murdered. I hope he slips up and self-destructs. <laughs> I can sense some chivalry behind their actions. They are clever to take the silent resentments of the public into account and relieve them. I believe that may be the secret to their popularity. Well, this is surprising. Your stance seems to have softened. This doesn't change the fact that they are dangerous. However, no. I shouldn't say anymore. Oh man. Come on, you can say it. Oh no, I won't be falling for that. I've learned my lesson after the previous backfire. So he's basically saying he's falling in line. These thieves are more popular than the police or politicians. What's the world coming to? Rude. What are you so angry about? Hey, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Take care of any customers that show up. All right. So. I finished the analysis. You know, of the data. Yeah, what'd you find? Want to meet now? I mean, sure. <laughs> Seriously, jet lag? I was about to say it's got to be bad. Fine then. Tomorrow. All right. Man. Well, the days passed and you okay, Morgana? What's up? Aw, oh, man. Ah, okay. Well, when we're not tired, we'll be able to talk to, to Futaba, figure out what kind of information she got, and we'll also be able to talk to Morgana and see what's up. So, um... But yeah, we basically learned today. Wow, that's that's a lot of information. The SIU director is connected with the person who is causing the mental shutdowns, and whoever is causing the mental shutdowns murdered Kobayakawa. Wow, well... It'll be interesting to see what happens. Uh, yeah. But next time on Let's Play Persona 5, we're gonna see what kind of information that Futaba was able to find. We're gonna see what's going on with Morgana. And with the information that we get, we're probably... Well, I don't know if we're gonna use the information for that, but, um... We'll likely move on to our next target soon. So, thank you to my patrons. William Nintendo Black Crisis, Joseph from Joe Bro Show, and Drew Haddad, and Trilight. I've been Kim Ronnie. thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys back here next time. Goodbye, guys.